The city of Baguio was planned for 25,000 persons. Now, its daytime population goes up to hundreds of thousands. We all want to have a piece of the city and the neighboring town of La Trinidad. We stake our claims on every available space. The streams and rivers are not spared. Houses should be uh, away from the bank of the river. Uh, there's a uh, three meters uh, easement, but uh, the houses are already over the creek, so we cannot uh, prevent it, uh, from uh, uh, the houses throwing uh, garbage to the uh, to the uh, river. Despite prohibitions, we also throw our garbage into the river. I remember that the change in Am Amin was when there was this uh, calamity. And then, yeah, that, that, that part of country, along the river, and uh, the houses is in the And I think one of the. It, it, uh, effect was some of the people who died who were who drowned because it was in the middle of the night mm -hmm. were, were, were fished out there in this portion so we were kids then watching because it created something the freshness and everything parang it changed also no? uh, and ultimately with, with all this uh, based on the studies of our BS environmental science students who, are, who have been making researches on the river, the river is really polluted. You can see all of the plastics that are placed over there. The river is not clear. Yeah, the water is very murky. Uh, the river has undergone siltation, not only in this area where I am, but in many other parts of the river, which has uh, made the river very constricted. Now, the total suspended solids nga parameter that you DJ masukat tayo DJ gay mayan anod nga sa rukit nga nagito nga magapu iti construction, let's say digging, sa slides, kit eh, may juno dum tanti pinagtutudo apo, na ito yung maten iti pakasukatan nga ngumato unay. Kahit nga sa una, dum maten iti discharges tayo in terms of total suspended solids. Basi iti rumumor iti result at the analysis. Look at the heavy metals, like the lead, the lead, mercury, cadmium. Ket uh, makikita tayo met nga at dati malala tayo ng traces iti heavy metals. Now, ijay bio di jago ko na tayo ng biochemical oxygen demand. Na ito nga ijay uh, angin o na ito angin nga nausar iti uh, bacteria nga manglinis yung karayan. Kasi at dati bacteria nga kung kunan tayo nga Mangkaan kada gitu yung rugit, kiti masuksukat ije bio di, kada gitu pana mausar danga angin ng mangkaan dito yung rugit nila ito. So tigon nata yung biochemical oxygen demand. Iso iti may isang masuksukat kiti makita tayo nga nangatu unay. Kahit nga sa uwen, dahil ito yung bakterya, adong unay iti makonkonsum ng oxygen ije danum, nalalain, at nulaing malinisan na rito yung karayan. Adong unay, kahit nga sa uwen narugit ije karayan. Now, iti bio di supposed to be dapat uh, less than 5 milligrams per liter ng sukatan dito analysis na kit uh, na nga ito unay. Kit inya da gito yung aruget ng masuksukat na iso da gito yung da gito yung magapu iti household. Ma, more or less da gito yung sewage tayo, da gito yung magapu iti septic tank. Numaming sanpay kit hanga magna di septic tank. Da gito yung magapu iti yung kitchen tayo. So da gito yung iti mang contribute. Da gito yung rugit ng ano pa kit masukat tayo iti BOD. So, kung nata yung uh, medyo nagbalbalin maten ng uh, sewerage system tiba dili.
we don't realize that what we throw into the river has a way of coming back to us. These solid vegetables are being watered by the Balili River. The Balili River irrigates the farms and flowers of Bahong and other barangays of La Trinidad. When we assumed office, uh, it was our commitment uh, that we will uh, really do everything uh, within our authority to uh, protect uh, this river. And we're not talking of Bahong only, we're talking of Al Alno, Alapang and uh, Bahong, the source of uh, the main source of roses and uh, chrysanthemums, no? chrysanthemums uh, which are being sold back to Baguio and which are all of which are being used during Panagbenga and all other activities that we have. Some of them sa Alno, diretso na rin sa Maynila, no? they go straight to uh, Dangwa in Manila. Farmer Eduardo Chio says they will fight anybody who will stop the flow of water into their farms. The Balili River is converted into hydroelectric energy. They have four plants there. And uh, uh, the agreement is, I think, 25 years, 25 years. So uh, we really have to sit down uh, together because we have also contributed to, to their business uh, more than what maybe we can do. <coughs> but these maintenance men say garbage often disturbs the generation of electricity. Actions are now being done to save Balili. Uh, this is a work of the DPWH and uh, they're trying to rip up this part of the Balili River so that it would at least uh, become wider and prevent sediments from uh, uh, affecting the river. I was looking at the other building, the other side, and I saw uh, somebody from that house, no, putting all the garbage, throwing all the garbage directly to the river. I said, because, ano ba naman to? You know, I, 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 there was something that, that it, it, it struck me na uh, sometimes wala gusto mong batuhin na huwag naman. give them seminars and uh, we uh, give also vermi to treat their uh, uh, waste animal waste we are also giving the uh, bio bio uh, bio digester gas if they want to use that uh, we go barangay by barangay nandiyan yung uh, 
uh, STP or the Bio, uh, the uh, Baguio Sewage Treatment Plant to treat uh, the uh, uh, waste coming from uh, the Central Business District and other adjacent uh, barangays. We have 120 barangays and uh, the uh, uh, total barangay that are uh, connected to the uh, uh, STP is uh, 65 barangays. At da no makita tayo kada giti balbalay magiti gigigit at damot yun nakadirekta na amu tayo no lababo ta at damot iti no napagaan da kito yan mapagpagaan da pay at damot yun sumurot iti lintek at damot lata di yun natangkan ti ulo na may and there are direct discharges no kuna tayo ng direct discharge san nga magna iti septic tank diretso yung karayan at damot iti monitoring ti sep mo di Baguio kaya adumat iti na doktalan da adumat iti sinusuratan da ang panggap ka na gito dito There is now an interagency coalition to save the Balili River The Balili River is a source of life. We have the uh, uh, Solid Waste Act, which is 9003. We have ordinances about this. But we don't need to read that. All we have to do is simply let us not throw our waste directly into Balili River because Balili River is not made for uh, wastewater treatment facility or a, a place where we can throw our waste. There is always a venue for that. There is a, there's a place for that. Let's save our life. Daito ikit kung kung natin yung self-assessment lang yun eh. May sak ba nga contributor? Ito rugit nga lang eh. No may sak, anya nga tati Aramidak. I think everybody is guilty as far as this is concerned. Kanayon nga salsalot sudet nga rugmit po nga kwano that in workshops or seminar on water quality, have you ever tried to look at your septic tank? Na lagip mo ka di nga pinanunot no ay na iti papapanan iti rugit mo. But really there's a need for us to protect the Balili River specifically, uh, it's a source of life and any, any river is. It really uh, pains us to see other rivers that have uh, dried up and uh, how about the next generation. Let's save the Balili River.